Welcome back guys. We are going to be playing with planes today, I think. Um, because we have the new bigger airports, we have bigger planes. So I think I want to update the three airports that we already have to utilize that, you might say. Uh, so yeah, we're going to do that. I did go ahead and I have updated all of our ships, both here and down south, so that they are now the new Violas and uh, Axe Alps. Uh, so hopefully that will loosen up the shipping lanes a little bit, because there are a lot of ships. There's still a lot of ships, but there are a lot less now than there were before, because the Violas and Axe Alps can carry a lot more goods. Uh, so. Hopefully that'll be a good thing for us, and we can uh, continue on, can continuing on. So th that's the plan, anyway. That's the plan. So yeah, uh, let's have a look at our airports. Uh, we have an airport here. We don't have that many passengers waiting, but there are some. And if we take a look at our uh, plane lines, well, two of them are making money, one of them is losing money. Which is annoying, because it was ma making money. Um, it was making money. Up here, we have a few. And down here in Lisbon, we have a few. It's not a lot. But let's start down here mainly because I think that's going to be the easiest one. So if we take a look at the airfield that we have now and compare it to the passenger airport, the passenger airport is just a tad bigger. <laughs> just a tad bigger. Plus, I want to have... I may want to have two runways. Probably will want to have two runways, to be honest. So we're going to need more space than this. We're going to have to move it down here or something. Uh, so let's uh, bulldoze you. Bulldoze that road there. And we kind of put it in here, which I think would be fine. So, if we get a road going, why isn't it locking? It's a little annoying. Oh, we'll get that road going there. And we'll get our airport in here. Okay. And then we can configure that and we can get a second runway in. Uh, I kind of want it going the other way. Can't I get it going the other way? I don't want both of them going the same way. Uh, maybe I don't have a choice. Oh, no, no, I, I remember, I remember. Uh, so... But we also... Uh, so, second runway. And... Watch the approach lights over here on that. Uh... And then we want taxiway, which I want to go that way. Okay. So that's that. Don't have any passengers right now. Uh, this still covers it, but it's a bit too far away. So I think we will... Destroy that, and we'll put in um, a new one right here. Uh, 
And this is now Humberto Delgado. Good. Okay, and then we definitely need to do something about this over here. So that just looks weird. All right. So that's that one done. That's that one done. Oh, there are a lot of trucks in a long line here. Well, hopefully, hopefully that loosens up. All right, so we can play the game a little bit more. Uh, let's try and get this to loosen up a bit by doing something like that. That'll hopefully help a bit. Maybe something like that. Okay. And no, yeah, there are traffic lights. Uh, traffic lights, turn off, turn off. Okay. That'll hopefully help a bit in the long run. Should. Should. Okay. Well, we did one of the airports. Uh, let's take a look here. Now, this is going... We're going to basically tear down this entire mountain. Uh... Hmm. I don't think we have a choice about that. Ah, uh, oh, there's a plane on the way in. It won't let us delete it right now, I think. Well, until that's gone. Man, it's laggy right now. Stop lagging. We have a lot of people waiting at the bus. 57. Park Circle is making money. There's only one on there. And we have quite a lot of people waiting. So let's uh, replace you with something a little bit more modern. The Mercedes Benz. So you have a capacity of 8, the Gaganau. Now this will take it up to 14. And then I think we'll clone it. Have another one on there. Okay. So that'll help that. Uh, and oh, damn it, another train came, or another plane came in, not a train. Planes generally don't fly. When they do, it's generally not a good thing. Alright, let's destruct you. I don't think we have a choice but to do this. That mountain is going away because we want an airport. That's okay though. Uh, configure. 
let's get that runway let's get the approach lights and let's get the second taxiway there we go and we will definitely move this out some I think that's probably okay uh, just down here like that that's fine okay so that's the second airport in and then it's London and I'm not sure that we'll be able to fit London in there I think we might have to come down a little bit more south with this road Let's get that plane out of the way. Okay. We'll lose that. And let's try and see. Ah, there's no way. <laughs> there's absolutely no way that that's going to fit in there. All right. Uh, let's bulldoze this road. have it come down as much as we can so it'll come down something like this And come in there oh and we need the uh, bus stop I don't know where I want that until we have the airport in and I'm still not sure that we'll be able to fit it in here we won't it's too big so how could we fit it in here I don't think we can. I mean, how the heck are we going to fit an airport in here? Suppose we could fit it in if we did something like this. Uh, I think we're going to have to do something like that. So let's build those this road again. For now. And we'll destroy that for now. And we'll try and get this road going. Up this way. And then up like that. And we'll get the um, cargo station in again on this side like that and now can we get our airport in here we're having a collision right now with what What exactly are we colliding with right now?
I don't see us colliding with anything. Oh, there it was. In you go. And... That means we want the passenger stop in here. This is going to be London Heathrow. Uh, this is going to be Heathrow Glass Terminal. Okay. We need to fix those lines a bit. Okay, but I also need. Try and get this extra runway in. Collision. What are we colliding with? We're not colliding with anything. Is it the road there? It might be the road there. Still colliding with something. Is there a little something here that I don't see? No. Might have to make do with one here. Because I have no idea what I'm colliding with. Uh, let's see... That's one of them fixed. And then you. Uh, remove. Add. Okay. And then. London Circle. Oh, we have two going here, actually. Uh, well, we'll. Where is the line? And after middle lane, we want to go to Heathrow bus terminal. And then another one. After South Street, we want to go to Heathrow bus terminal. Hey. That fixes those lines. Now let's fix this terrain a bit, shall we? So that looks terrible. Something like that. Looks a little bit more natural. Okay. We have all that in. We have, don't have any warnings. All good. Now, if we take a look at uh, planes, uh, we could upgrade to... This is a cargo. Uh... Hmm. If we do the Boeings or the Canadairs, well, we want passenger things. So I guess it's the De Havilands. De Havilands. They have a capacity of 21, which means that we only want one of them on our on our, on our, on our thing. Wow. 
you have these old ones as well. The Gagan House. Uh, let's replace those with the Mercedes Benz. And you two. Right, that's better. going to sell one of these and then I am going to replace you with the de Havilland Comet okay and I'm going to do the same for all three lines I think uh, let's sell you and replace you And then you can come down here and do the same for this one. Okay. I don't understand what's what I'm colliding with here. There's really nothing to collide with. Let's take a look at the de Havilland Comet. Well, that looks pretty cool. Whoa, it's coming in low. Didn't, wouldn't want to live in those houses. But it's a pretty good looking aircraft. I like it. Yeah, very nice aircraft. Very nice aircraft. All right, new train stuff and some new um, I guess these are trams. Hey. Well, we have those three things done. Now, let's see. You'll get how much here? Oh, it's loading slow, huh? 148. We're not at all up to our. Might need to get some new trains here. And what is the rate on this line? Well, that's not what I wanted to click. Eleven hundred and fifty-five, which mean, should mean that we we get well, well about around around this actually. Oh well, yeah, we might need to get some new trains on here. Problem is that they're waiting there all the time. ton of wood sitting here. I don't suppose we got new uh, cargo wagons that can carry more. Uh, let's see, we have the class A4. Let's try and take a look. These two 120. Uh, how much does the class A4 do? 145. Uh, 
Okay, but that's kind of fine. 100, uh, 1200 kilowatts and 160 kilonewtons. So this has more kilowatts, but about the same kilo or attractive effort. So they would go a little bit slower, so what it really comes down to is if we put one of these on and what's the latest we have these ones with 13 they can also only do 120 so that's fine and we can have them at 320 meters right So 320 meters, that gives them a capacity of 221. There we go. Okay, what happened there? Weird. We gonna have a problem here. I think we're gonna have a problem here. Here we are. Uh, damn it! Uh, you know what? Let's just sell you. And we got more new vehicles. And then we can... So what's the rate on this line now? 1,512. That's pretty much what it should be. Uh, we need to get... Um, this signal bulldozed, I think. And then we need a signal up here. Okay. So, do you have logs on board? You do. Excellent. So this will hopefully speed this up and even with three trains <clears throat> we have a higher rate than we did before uh, maybe not we'll see Okay, so you're unloaded. Hopefully this goes up. I want it to 800. Hmm. 262, no, we need another train on here. Okay. <clears throat> I hate that they have to sit there and wait though. I really hate that they have to sit there and wait. But this should work. Uh, I think we need to bulldoze this signal as well and then let's put one in there all right so you're waiting 
They're going. Okay, you're on your way in. Okay. Our rate is way too high right now. Has to be, right? 1974. Not that way too high, actually. So... Uh, let's just put a quick little signal in right here. Oh, I keep forgetting, making them one way, but it's... never mind, never mind. That's okay. Alright, so... Our planes got updated. Our airports got updated. Uh, and we updated that train line, we updated a few buses, so that's good, we have a lot going on here. Um, To do that. Will that help a bit? Maybe. I don't know. Alright, so that's that fixed up. We can't do this here. This is just gonna have to be. Twenty-one food sitting. How many trains do we have on this? Four. Why do I have four trains on this? Do we need four trains on this? We have a rate of six hundred and fifty-six. Hmm. I don't really think we need a lead for trains on this. I think we could go down to a lot less. Maybe two if we extended them. Because this is a 320 station, I'm pretty sure. We can certainly make the trains a lot longer. We can certainly make the trains a lot longer. We do not have a whole lot of tools sitting here. I mean, we've got one, we've got three, two, zero. Your rate is 788, so your your rate is actually pretty spot on. But we're not getting enough shipment by any means, which is weird. Uh, how many tools do you need? 90? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Something happened. Um, let's slow down a bit. I knew there would be a collision there. Uh,
Oh man. Let's do this. I mean, this could actually be a long term solution. If we just put a road in here. That could work. And remove the signal. Okay, let's see how that does. Uh, let's remove the traffic light there as well. Let's just let that loosen up. Uh, I'll let that loosen up a bit in between episodes. This over here is horrible as well. Uh, what vehicles do we have on here? We have the Volvo flatbeds. Alright, so if we select all these and say replace cargo, what can we get now? So the Volvo LV flatbeds. What can they carry? 13. Uh, that bed here can carry 18 to 22. So what did that do for our rig here? I don't think that rate is correct. Uh, okay, so we did one of these. This is the other one. Uh, what's your rate right now? 511. Flatbeds, uh, replace, and then we need to sell some of them. Let's sell eight of them. Okay. Oh, yeah. Hopefully this loosens things up a bit. I think we'll need to sell some on the other on the other line as well. The rate is 526 now. Oh, we did get eight vehicles that were going in there out of there. And then here we have 38 with a rate of 621. If we replace you... Oh, we got the Susus with these. 
Now we have a rate of 949, which is way too much. Let's sell three. Let's sell three more. That's about right. So that's more trucks that don't need to get in here. And this has, in fact, loosened up a bit. What? They're loaded differently. Okay. Okay, how many do you have? 13 of 22. You have 13 of 22. That's weird. They're loaded differently. Well, let's hope this loosens up a bit. I mean, right now it's, it's just that there are so many vehicles that want to unload that we have the problem over here. I don't actually know if this is going to loosen up. What are you go Where are you going, Albert Robinson? Why are you going into my... <coughs> my truck stop? You must be lost. What the heck is he doing? Get out of there, Albert! Where is he going, I wonder? He's going... over here, okay. Why didn't he just go up that way? Instead of... backing up my trucks! That is so weird. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Well, I haven't ever seen that before. So where are you going now? Right, he's out of there. Okay. We might need to update these vehicles as well because they are... What do we have on here? Uh, well, we can't even see what they're called, but... I have a capacity of 13. We could update so that I have a capacity of 22 or something. And get fewer vehicles on there. Which I think would be a good thing. But it's something that we'll have to worry about another day, because we are out of time. So yeah, we did the airport, we did a bit of line maintenance, and that's all good. So thank you very much for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.